Now, if you look at the signs of uh, what could actually affect dopamine levels, well, stress can have an impact on dopamine level. Why? Because when I'm under stress, I increase cortisol, and in cortisol will increase the production of adrenaline. And adrenaline is made from dopamine. So the more stress you're under, the more adrenaline you produce, the more you can deplete your dopamine. Eventually, it will create what we call dopamine depletion. We will see in a few moments how to know if you are dopamine depleted or your receptors are becoming resistant. Stimulants, like those fat burners, ephedrine, very high amount of caffeine, especially in pills form. From coffee, it's not as bad. From a pill form, it's a lot worse. Now, those stimulants will either increase the production of adrenaline or will increase the stimulation of the dopaminergic receptors. In both cases, it, it's bad. But if it increases adrenaline, because it, they, they, they increase cortisol, and that cortisol will increase noradrenaline to adrenaline conversion, then you need to replenish the noradrenaline, so you need to take that dopamine. So the more adrenaline you produce because of the stimulants, the more you are depleting that dopamine. High blood sugar. We will see that too much carbs when you're eating decreases the transport of tyrosine versus the transport of tryptophan. Tryptophan and tyrosine are two amino acids. So every time you eat protein, you are eating tyrosine and tryptophan. And both are utilizing the same transporter to get absorbed and transported so they can be used to produce neurotransmitter. Tyrosine produces dopamine, tryptophan produces serotonin. If I'm eating a lot more carbs than proteins and fat, you will favor the transport of tryptophan, thus transporting less tyrosine decreasing dopamine, increasing serotonin. If I'm eating less carbs, more protein, more fat, I'm absorbing more tyrosine, less tryptophan. So I'm increasing dopamine, decreasing or not increasing serotonin. So what you eat can actually have an impact on your transmitter level.